What's going on, y'all? Seek Paris. I'm up in here today pressing some shirts and getting prepared to do a photo shoot in a couple of days with my friend Isaac Turner. He's on Instagram, Isaac Turner Media. Check him out. He's real nice at what he do. And so we getting together, shooting a photo shoot because I'm going to be dropping that smoke some line. Them weed tees I've been designing. And y'all can see them coming up. So stick around. Just like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comments how y'all feel about these t-shirts. If you pro weed or you think weed shouldn't be around. You know what I mean? Put it in the comments. <laughs> try to use this t-square I've never used it I just watched a YouTube video on how to use it see how it works out for me lying on my shirts See how this work laying out my shirt on this piece of cardboard. So have some to settle in. So I was saying to line the, these arrows up with the collar. This slides on like that. And for this one, I'm gonna go about three inches down. That's the design, smoke some. Right, it's heat tape. Get my design in place. But before I do that, Grab this one, bro.
Some we we'll just set this over here. Move on to the next.
that moisture up out of there real quick. Lost my designs there for a second. I'm not gonna do that one yet because I gotta know. I don't know exactly how to do the chest piece. I've never done one. Research a little bit before I do it. So all these designs I made, you know, I'm learning. So this is the I Love Wade one. I'm still learning, trying to figure it out. So bear with me. Have it right, y'all. It's gonna be right. Do some little some every day. To advance myself in it. on the computer, something every day. So ten thousand hours I'm going for it.
cardboard makes it so much easier to handle. So that's two shirts in. And I've been recording for about 20 minutes. So and I got four more left to go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut this off right here. It's true stoners only. Super stoner. We smoke some. And the one y'all seen, I'd rather get high. So I got FOMO shirts to press up. So I'm gonna press them. I'm gonna stop this video here. I'm gonna press them up and I'll show y'all the finished product so this video is not three days long. <coughs> Alright, so here's one of the shirts. True stoners only. So I made neck labels and I'm going to use my hat press to press those in. Let's turn this shirt inside out. It's the first time I've ever done this too. So everything, man, I told you, everything here, man, it's, we learning. So when there's a label, I'll show it to you once it's pressed, see it a little better. So again, I'm going 400. Then these cricket shirts, they got an XL tag or whatever size, like this one is an XL. They got a tag built into the shirt so I didn't have to put size on my label. Oh, let me get a little piece of paper. safe and we're going to take this down.
See how that work out. I've never done this again. Like I said, I've never done this. It just seemed like the logical way to put labels in your shirts. Separate these so they're easier to grab. I ended up pressing six shirts, six different designs. I believe two I did with the chest logo like this one and another one and then the rest with big logos on front. Um, after this, after I get these labels in, I got my shirt fold. I'm going to use that and um, fold them up, bag them up, and get ready. Or actually, I don't think I'm going to bag them. I don't think I'm going to bag them for the shoot. I'm going to just stick them on hangers. Grab some on this next one. Not too bad. I wish you can see my name a little better, but the information is in there. Follow us on Instagram. Drawing instructions, watching instructions. Just set this side. There's another one, the Superstar. That was a little bigger <clears throat> on the chest. Just be having fun and learning. Every day I learn something new. Um, really, like, if you'd asked me a year ago, would I be doing this? Would I be like making shirts to go do a photo shoot for? I would have had to say no. It was always a dream, but to like do a brand, I got some other original designs, sketches, and stuff I had done that eventually I'll be putting on. Those are more music related. I just wanted, I decided to do the pot because the pot is a, uh, it's a niche. And this is what I haven't been, I didn't do first time. But, so I decided to go with niche and see how that go because like I said, I live here in Eugene, Oregon and weed is life here. So, I decided to just go with some money get some money not working is just brainstorming my wife helps me brainstorm just try something I know that typically that tag should be like straight middle so I'll fold it and try to place it. Sorry, I'm going off camera. I'm just getting my tape. Get a piece of tape. I may not even need it, but I just feel better about having it, you know? Here we go, round two. 
some grass and hangers. Uh, you probably look good on the hanger, don't it? Hang it in the closet here in a second. Boom. Number two. Guess I could have turned these inside out prior to me starting. Sorry. One thing I do like about these Cricut shirts is that tag is already there for the size. So for my labels, I didn't have to worry about placing my size for each individual shirt. It's already in the shirt looking professional. Feel like I should Turn these rest of these shirts inside out while I wait. lucky when I put it in upside down. <clears throat> Got to be more careful next time.
Whoever get that one got a freebie coming or something. I don't know. We'll see. That one's special. I've been doing wrong. Telling you all, everything I'm telling you, I'm learning. Which one of y'all could have screamed to me, though? On the last three shirts to do this. Good looking out, people. <laughs> This hat press for I don't know, maybe I don't know. I bought it, I guess, sometime last year. I barely use it, I've used it like twice. But doing this is perfect for it, it'll definitely get some, some play now because I thought about using it for. putting these labels in. Thank you. 
when you type it going green with this tape. I got to lay this last one down so I'm gonna just pick it up and continue just because it's what we was doing I don't normally want to stretch it out for y'all but I'm bored wife's at work I'm sitting here by myself bored y'all keeping me company right now Tight last a good while, at least for what I do. Strips holding down this stuff. Next time I get a wire on. I originally got this heat tape because I, um, well, I had a hat press. There's a way you can do hats with a heat press, but it called for you to use um called for you to use heat tape to hold it down. And that's why I originally got it. I made a few hats that way. A few of my personal hats. The one y'all see me wear uh, with the hoodie, the new king to the throne. I actually made that hat on my heat press before I had a hat press. If y'all like to learn how to do that, I can do a video on that. Just put it in the comments. So I'm just cut that off. Boom. Dang, I wasn't paying attention. Cut that one off a little bit. Some mistakes, man. We're going to make mistakes. We're going to learn from them, though. these on the hanger
think this is my favorite one. Back when I was a pothead, I would have loved to, I would have loved to have this shirt. That's why the smoke something. That was my <laughs> that was my slogan. Everybody knew me. Know when they see me, man. Smoke something. Sorry, I could have been doing this while the other shirts was pressing. But it's the last one. So, I'd rather be high. Super stoner. Weed. Smoke something. I love weed. Smoke some. And the true stoners only pocket tea, logo tea. Um, like I say, all these designs I've made in like the last week came up with it. So I'm gonna just do weed designs. It came up. I got some more that I wasn't thinking. I didn't. I didn't want to press. I was like, I'm gonna just pick these six. Take these. Like I say, my little partner. My partner, my friend, Isaac Turner, he a photographer, videographer, you do music videos and all that. Um, he got some good content on his Instagram, on the link in the description. He took a school bus and rebuilt it and all that. He documents that on YouTube, the whole nine. Like the dude's real good at what he do. And he gonna come down Tuesday, we gonna do a photo shoot for these. And the brand is going to be launched. 12 going apparel, man. See Paris. I'll see y'all later.